getting this started. Hey, yeah. you, welcome to Quillbriar. We're back in Minecraft again today, and we're heading over to Falkirk to check out what's been going on. I'm, I'm just sitting here at the portal station because it's been redecorated big time <laughs> and it's kind of nice I mean have you guys know all the flower pots we changed the mods recently and I'm sitting here looking at this big avenue that was a kind of an avenue of flowers before and and it's all bare I do so much decorating with flower pots and it's just occurred to me this very second that I have got to go through all my buildings and plant for a month it's going to be horrible <laughs> yeah oh my goodness because look this this is really showing here we've got all these light posts and and the flowers are gone so i'm going to tp over i'm on the way okay um two flying scotsman there we go ah i'm in your brain <laughs> <laughs> there's a view oh in my favorite i was showing off your other fountain this morning already it'll be going online here in just a little while Way. um because I, I have my favorite chair there in the Riverwalk Cafe, and then that fountain is just, oh, it's so beautiful. <laughs> it's not finished yet. Well, it, look, it looks pretty good but to I don't me. But I don't want to spoil the whole entire um, area that it's sitting on, so I won't go too nuts with it. Be Things true. like flowers and whatnot still need to go on <clears> it, and <throat> some sort of walking uh, path to go around it or something. Ah, well, it looks fabulous. So what am I getting to see today? Well, I've seen as we did here... The other week there, um, <clears throat> pop over and see the homes over that direction. That direction. And um, I'll see what's starting over here. So, of course, for those, if you have missed the earlier recording, this is the Quillbriar version of the Vatican. And I encourage you to go back and check out that recording because there's some really nice touches in here. And, <clears throat> and from the looks of it, you are continuing the Italy theme. This is uh -huh. pretty nice. Oh my goodness, I like this. Oh, look at these buildings. And it has a big porch. Oh, what a view. Imagine getting to sit out here with a glass of wine at night. Look at this. Uh, I, th I think Nero would be happy about that. Nero's still in here, eh? I'm lurking. There, yeah, I'm lurking. <laughs> Is Giggling here? but lurking. Look at this view. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we could have a good we could have a nice evening or two here, I think. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Oh, these are beautiful. Nice big rooms. Mm. Yep, yeah, this is I think I I told you that at the start of how I was gonna go about this story kinda end of the town is this is a, a couple who are I wouldn't say they're not rich, but they're comfortable. Um, which is why they have the biggest house so far and they have their own vineyard which we'll go out and see in a minute and their own area for making wine and um, they, they actually hire some of the slightly more poorer people which will go into their looking houses um, next and they come over and they help make the wine along with the, the couple that live here they do a lot of um, entertaining which is why they have the big table here yeah, I'm loving this table this is nice. Which is why the house is still pretty beer because they just don't have the time to be <laughs> indoors. I like these guys. <laughs> They've got a big kitchen and lots of room to invite lots of people over for happy meals. But then they're just outside doing the vine stuff. I like it. Uh, this is where they put sleep is up here. Bathroom in there. And oh, nice Not much in there. Nice big one. Oh, and a shower, I take it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and you peer around here. Oh, look at this. It's got indoor plumbing and everything. <coughs> you know, the props. <clears throat> Excuse me. The new props mod is going to make, um, is making life so much easier in some ways with some mm -hmm. of the new toys we have. They're so awesome. Oh, this one's even better. I like being up high. Yeah. It's, oh. Ooh, this will come and relax for the evening. Catch those cool breezes. Watch the mm -hmm. flags flap in the wind, and they can just you can see the top of the the fountain over here. That's nice. Very nice touch. Yeah. And I did fix the flags. I did that just earlier on. I got the where they're not with the yellow X's on the top of them now. 
So they're all filled in. Oh, okay. With glowstone and carpenter blocks and. Oh my goodness! Very, very clever. Yeah, I like that. I've noticed. I've noticed you guys have have done that a lot. You you use the carpenter block that flattens, and you you sort of just put a quick layer over something, and you've still got light coming through, uh -huh. but you have this very you know barely noticeable. Uh, you can make it match any any pattern, and I didn't know how you did that for a while, and. Then I discovered it one day and went, oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> this is brilliant. Shutters on all the windows and look at the view in the morning. The sun comes up to wake you up in the morning. Very nice. <clears throat> I'll head out the back. Oh, I missed a sheep to visit us. <laughs> you make sure we close the door. I used to have goats that would come in the house at every available opportunity. So... Oh my goodness gracious, this is amazing. Look at this with the vines. Nice. Yeah. Okay, nice touch. Very. Just the jungle hedge and just pretending that they're, they've got the grapes and whatnot growing on them. And then and there's food. A little farm for, the, for helping to make the wine itself. Got a horse here trying to get through the fence in the corner. <laughs> This is so nice. I really, I really, really love the style of these houses. And, you know, the fact that the same, they're all different houses, but the style is there. Because you see that in a lot of villages, mm -hmm. in a lot of places in the world. You'll, you'll have that sort of, you know, the, the local materials and the local, you know, somebody liked something, so they carry it on in their own house. And you get a real nice sense of community. And this house is fabulous. All these porches and balconies just make me crazy happy. I love it. I'll take a run to the the actual wine holding area, which is small. I might actually adjust and make this a little bigger. It's quite it's quite cramped. Well, it would be the oh look, you made your own big barrels. Okay, yep. that's fabulous. Look at this. We have vats. Yep, a couple of vats. Okay, that's pretty cool. I had I didn't I've not seen this. I just assumed with the new props thing you would have just put one of those barrels down or something, but you you had all this done even before. Yeah, this has been done a long a long time ago. So um I have I haven't played too much with the prop mod yet. Um with the other server that um we were involved with Hague, we were kinda of playing around with it a little bit more on that one. And that's why we have it now here in Colebriar. Oh, it's fabulous. I love it. It's, you know, and it, it, getting it at this time of the year with, you know, all the holiday decorating bits of it. Mm -hmm. But this this is great. I would have never thought. I have often said, okay, I really would like to have something that looked like a big barrel for exactly this sort of thing. And I kind of never got around to trying anything. But, I mean, it's mm -hmm. a size that works because they would be big. Yeah. This is brilliant. Very clever. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> Very clever. In the big vats with the purple. <laughs> mm -hmm. Purple. And yeah, just the purple um, clay. Oh, that's so good. What a nice area. <clears throat> you got the water right there. Yep. And then we'll head into the slightly purer homes these are really tight with uh, the amount of um space and how much is actually inside these are pretty much done uh these couple of buildings okay so, so you got your kitchen it's a family of four you go upstairs so there's the first that's where the, the kids would sleep on this floor and then on the top floor would be where the parents would sleep so this building it looks really big, but it's actually like a couple of a couple of flats. Like it's yes, yes, very um, nice. Trying to see what the the actual inside of a the Italian homes of this style was. It's been quite hard to see that because obviously it's people's homes that uh, they live in. But what I've noticed with um, looking at a couple oh, of nice. pictures of it, these kind of buildings were actually done um, on a hill. They weren't so much um, flat. So if you were to take the, the double building and maybe lift the second one two or three blocks higher so it would be offset, that's how they would actually step up as if they were going up a hill. 
Oh my good, that would look so cool. No, mm-hmm. you, you got a hill I'm, anywhere? <laughs> I want to yes, see. Yes, I do have a hill. I do have a hill. <laughs> that oh. big, great big hill when you came through the portal station. That's right. Yeah. Oh, this is really nice. This is so nice. I I, I love it. He he's done so much research before he started this project. I mean, he's actually gone out and, and looked for, well, obviously with, with the Vatican build, you know, he did, looked at film. He watched a documentary about building yeah. the building so <laughs> so he could get it right. <laughs> well, tried to, tried to. Oh, that's amazing. I think I'll be changing the, the glass in the back end that's behind you. Maybe use the stained glass of some sort mm-hmm. and create something in those glass. I hear we've got a couple of different kinds of stained glass now, I think. Yeah, oh, yeah. The, the stained glass that's in the prop mod. Yeah. If I remember right, that's in there. And then we can make it with um, tinkers, right? Uh-huh. Yeah, mm-hmm. very nice. And then that's basically how big the a single one would look. And they're, they're all exactly the same. There's no there's no difference on in what's inside. It's just the position and all, like where the kitchen oh, is. Nice. and And then... But again, before we got the prop mod, I built a kid's play area. Oh. <laughs> which I was thinking, well, I could take it down and use the prop stuff. Because there is some of the stuff that works in there. But the catch part is you can't actually use, I would say, the prop mod stuff to, like, go into or sit on or anything like that. So, no, I thought, I'll actually build it. This is so fun. Oh, my goodness. You get this big playhouse. Look at the little seats. And you can climb out. Monkey, yeah, monkey bars, swing. <laughs> Single swing over here. Uh, sand pit underneath. Okay, that's really clever. Where you get the chain link fence when the sand the swing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's pretty cool. <laughs> and then you use the the co- the, the spider webs, the cobwebs yeah. as a climbing frame to get up but you really also you can't go up on it but you can come down okay, using it okay that's brilliant i gotta go try you gotta try <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, and as you can see goodness. people eva is using the slide to go up <laughs> of course because look and i'm going down really really slow <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness really can do it One more time, one more time. Oh, I know, one more, one more, one more, one more. Down, down. Poof, do it. There you go. (laughs) I did it. (laughs) Oh my god. But also, it doesn't work going backwards or upwards anyway. Oh, that would be painful even trying. (laughs) Uh Uh Oh, that's so cute. This is really cute. So you're going to so, have a whole town here. Well, yeah, it's going to build around the back of the Vatican. So it's going to work around behind you and then wrap around the other side. There'll be um, shops, store shops around here. Oh, ever nice. um, and then I'm going to probably put in a um, Italian styled school, which has been hard to look for, um, on especially for the style. Because oh obviously, they, they, obviously they probably upgraded their, their schools to a bit more modern, so it's kind of hard to hmm. find something a little bit more old-fashioned on how so it was going to look. We have to find some pictures of historic Italian schools. Yeah. There's, there's viewers, there's a project for you. Yeah. <laughs> Post the links below. Post the link and I'll have a look at it. I, I just don't need to go back to the first recording we did the other week there and see if we actually have a name for um the what do you call it the the tree house oh that's right we were we i were, haven't had a look yeah. yet to see if anybody's come up with. we were asking for names for ideas for names and that that's worked out for jasper he's ended up calling his place uh, meridia and mm-hmm. the, the village i oh i see i don't remember what the village was but he got it he got the idea from a post that one of the viewers um, something and he created I don't know if he actually took a name somebody suggested or if the name trying to triggered something in his own head mm-hmm. that allowed him to come up with something but 
but it's working. We're getting some things named. I like it. Yep. <laughs> oh, Italy. This is great. You know, this is a style like the, like the whole, this is not something we've had like anybody else has done. Again, it's, it's a brand new, it's a brand new way of building. It's a brand new look. It's a brand new field. And I love it. This is really nice. Yep. Really nice. And I like Italy. I keep thinking, you know, when I'm 80, I should retire to Italy. I can see me in a little back stone, a, a little porch like this, you know, a nice <laughs> porch, looking out over a vineyard. I, this, no lie. <laughs> this is a thing I've had in my head for a great many years. I would just be sitting on the back porch, looking out over a vineyard, you know, and I'd be in my little rocking chair kind of thing. I'd just be this little teeny little lady or retire to Cyprus. <laughs> that works too, Nerolosa. Absolutely, absolutely. And um, you know, I'd be playing, I'd be playing Minecraft, and World of Warcraft. <laughs> you know, in my little rocking chair, watching the grapes grow. I like it. <laughs> so and the workers that, going nuts. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so that image in my mind. We'll all oh, look at this view. Look at the view again. These guys do know how to create a world that is. Yeah, this is just fun so so much fun so thank you scotty yeah scotty the 33rd 33rd <laughs> it's been a popular name for popes in in minecraft so um there yeah. we go and thank you for the fountain in in whitehall i, I yeah it's beautiful it is and i i i'm serious about finding a place for another copy of that over in leckley because i do want to build a village around that fountain it's pretty spectacular so I love did Color Slide um, come up with a name over there? Because we didn't. We were talking about one last night. A name for the for where the fountain is. No, if he did, he didn't tell me. I, um, I mean, maybe he did, but we I were know. talking. Well, he'd mentioned about calling it the. Uh, I think it was the Lions Plaza. Well, considering the lions, I think it, it works. Yeah, just mm -hmm. build a plaza. Sounds great. Just do it. Have fun. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, goodness. Yeah, I'm, I'm loving the projects you guys are building over there. It's really nice. Really nice. That, oh, there's so much. The server, I, you know, I'm, I'm starting to fly around and, and um, Aver Kamen, it was Aver Kamen, was like, looking at the roads. They're starting to connect places and some of them are going on. They're quite long and they're connecting whole countries and, you know, places within the countries and you know, uh -huh. you, it's kind of reaching a point where you can be in one place and kind of look, if your computer is set, you can look way off into the distance and just see, you know, another uh, center of, of, um, of, of community building, whatever that, you know, there's another place over there and you get to that one and you can see another one up the road over here and there's starting to be all these things that connect. It, it's starting to feel like, yeah. it, you know, yeah. a real world. It's, um, took a while it's it's been a long time we've been at this for over a year a year and a half yep. a year and a half yep. this one yeah over here it's been about a year for the vatican yeah as is almost a year that is incredible <laughs> oh my goodness so that's it little italy yep. <laughs> Thank that's you pretty much what much. it will be it'll be just a little a little one there uh, so you guys know what I'm going to say. Please leave your comments. If you have name suggestions, we're always needing those. Like, subscribe if you haven't. And uh, live your life happy and build it beautiful. It, it's always a good choice, right? Mwah. Always, always. <laughs> Thanks, Mark. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.